Hi guys, welcome to this channel. My name is Jocelyn and I make videos about fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about how to look expensive, or should I say, how to look classy on a budget. I think it's more accurate how to look classy on a budget because expensive, right? The word expensive is very subjective. Looking expensive is an attitude, it's not a question of a wallet, right? All right, let's get started. First of all, let me tell you that to look expensive, you don't need to have money. You can be broke and you can still have class. For instance, there are a lot of celebrities that are multimillionaires and influencers, right? That are super like loaded in cash. However, they don't have class. Let me know in the description box below if you agree with me. And if you have examples, please let me know. I have several examples of classy ladies. For instance, Kate Middleton. She is a very classy lady and you can see it right away. And as you can see, she's not showing logo. Of course, that she has certain level. She doesn't need to show that she has money. However, she's always elegant and she always look like Polish. tip that I'm going to suggest to look classy or to look expensive is to dress on a monochromatic look. One color. It doesn't matter if it's a neutral color, if it's a bright color, it doesn't matter. If you like your bright colors, that's fine. You need to stay true to yourself, right? I am a lover of neutrals. I love black. I love my whites. I love my browns. And that's what works for me. There are going to be people that are like, okay, monochromatic look, I, yeah, I don't like it, that's boring. And I completely understand if you like your print, if you like your floral or your animal print, that's fine. You can wear it, just pair it with a neutral clothing, right? For instance, you can be wearing a floral top and a neutral color here at the bottom or vice versa, right? You can be wearing a loud print here at the bottom and here at the top, just keep it simple. Simple things are just a classy by nature. Yeah, keep it simple. What to say about makeup? I think that the more natural looking, the better the effortless the better however i think that if you like your eyes or your lips or you want to emphasize some feature of your face you should do it why not i have seen that oh no you need you know full makeup eyelashes no eyelashes you know what i think as long it looks natural and it doesn't look like bald and your face like you're gonna go on a wedding <laughs> right that's fine because if that makeup gives you the confidence to go through the day uh you should do it if you want to look classy i think that you should keep it simple keep it simple emphasizing the features of your face that you like the most for instance if you like your eyes that's okay if you like to emphasize your eyes if you like your lips doesn't matter the color of lipstick that you're gonna be wearing. I have been watching videos about this topic and uh, it's funny because they say, okay, red lip. And I have seen on TikTok as well, red lip and you're gonna look like, you know, super expensive. Really? I, I, I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. I mean, if the red color gives you confidence, uh, go for it. But if you like a nude color or, or orange color, and yeah that gives you the confidence go for it the more natural looking right of course that if you wear a black lipstick right or a you know green lipstick that's no classy that's more like halloween <laughs> you know what i mean right so keep it keep it simple uh, yes you can emphasize the features of your face that you love the most and that's the makeup that you should be wearing I think this is a basic guys, right? Personal hygiene is a must. We need to take showers and we need to take care of our hair, clean hair, clean ears, clean skin, clean nails, uh, you know, that's basic. So I'm not going to elaborate here. I think uh, it's very clear. Yeah, 
Okay, let's move on. <laughs> Speaking about hair, I mean, yes, you need to have clean hair, but messy hair is not classy. At least, you know, pass the brush through those strands of hair. <laughs> And if you feel like you have a bad hair day, just put on a ponytail or a bun, right? That's, that's easy to do. Don't show your greasy hair because that's not classy. That looks like you just don't care and you just not put in any effort to yourself. And that's pretty sad. So yeah, hair, please take care of your hair. Wash your hair, brush your hair, make yourself presentable to start the day. Of course, then I'm going to talk about the topic of the nails and which length should we, you know, have in order to look classy. I think it doesn't matter. If you like short nails, go for it. If you like long nails, go for it. The thing here is just to keep them clean and presentable. Cheap nails are a no no. Yeah, you know that. So if you're gonna be wearing nail polish, just make sure that looks good, right? As soon as you see that you have cheap nail polish, just remove it. And that's why it's very handy to have acetone right away, right? In case that you know that you're gonna have nail polish on your nails, you have a chip on your nail, just remove it, boom, that's it. If you know that you cannot keep with the maintenance of the nails, and I'm talking about, you know, long nails with nail polish, I think that if you cannot keep it up with their maintenance, just, just go bare nails. Just make sure that they look clean. And they clean themselves. When you take showers and you wash your hands, their nails get clean, <laughs> right? All right, so that's what I'm talking about. It's very simple. It doesn't matter the length, as long as you keep them clean and presentable, you will look classy. Wrinkles on your clothes, length on the fabric of your clothes, those tiny details that they don't make you look polished. And that's what I'm talking about. If you know that your shirt is missing a button, or just, you know what, just, so it in, right? Again, and you have a shirt like new again. Just make sure that your clothes look polished. Another tip to make sure that you are looking classy and expensive on a budget is your shoes. Take care of your shoes, guys. Make sure that they look clean. Dirty shoes are not classy. It's funny because I have seen on the market sneakers with stains on purpose and <laughs> I'm like, oh my gosh, okay, well, yeah, dirty clothes are not classy and they will never look expensive. They will look cheap and they will look like if you don't care, then you don't take care of yourself. Close the feet too tight or close the feet too baggy, that's a no-no. They will never look cute or expensive or classy, period, okay? Let's talk about super tight clothes. Tight here at the top and tight here at the bottom. And I'm talking about super tight. The tight that your asses are just coming out, okay? That type of tight because you can be wearing skinny jeans, they're tight, and uh, you know, a super cute body suit, they're tight, but they look cute, right? Because they're giving you a shape, they're giving you a silhouette. I'm talking about, you know, tight here at the top that your assets, your bust is just coming out from like everywhere. And tight here at the bottom that your muffin top is showing, you know what I mean, right? That type of tight is a no-no doesn't look flattering. This woman doesn't look classy, period. Now let's talk about too loose or baggy. Baggy clothes will never look expensive, will never look classy. Like for instance, this example, that's, 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 that doesn't look good, okay? I think that I made my point. Of course that you can wear oversized clothing. I'm not talking about that kind of oversized that will balance your outfit. Balancing the outfit is all what is this about. 
Balancing the outfit is when you know your body type and you are wearing tight or loose, right, on some sections of your body to balance your silhouette. That's dressing properly. And I have a full video here. <laughs> if you want to watch it, it's going to be here or in the description box below, but you can watch it after you finish this video. Back to the super tight clothes and the super like baggy clothes. Yes, they will never look cute. Showing the assets of your body on this way will never look cute or expensive or classy. And not showing the silhouette of your body will never, never look expensive and classy as well. confidence is the most important tip that I'm going to give you as part of this video. If you have confidence, you can just show it up to the world. If you are confident on whatever you're wearing, you will look like a million dollars. Honestly, you can be wearing a trash bag and if you have confidence, that will show up and that trash bag will look like super cute. <laughs> Honestly. Well, if you don't have confidence, they say fake it until you make it. Okay, and there are several ways that you can fake it. And if you follow the tips that I gave you first, I think that's a good way to fake it until you make it. If you have good personal hygiene, you take care of your nails, your hair, your shoes, your clothes are pristine, you are taking care of the details, you will be confident. Because you know what? Dressing well and taking care of yourself gives you confidence, absolutely. And knowing that your makeup is on point, your hair is on point, and you have a super like awesome outfit, that gives you confidence. If you have confidence on yourself, you will look expensive and you will look classy. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye bye.